Hey, how you doing? You know, I just thought I'd do this article or whatever, all right? I just know social injustice when I see it, all right? That basically a basketball game off a of foul play uh, and something that got, uh, turned out to be something that was made a big deal out of it and spiraled uh, out of control, okay? So let's get right into it right quick. There was uh, a basketball game in, uh, between uh, two teams in Orange County that either happened today or yesterday, all right? Uh, it was a young black lady, um, high school, again, this is a high school basketball game, has sucker punched a girl named Lauren Ham. all right? Um, and the mother of Lauren Ham had basically had filed a police report. I did an article about this before, all right, on the AAU with two boys were playing and a very similar play had happened, okay, an undercut, and the guy had swung on on this, uh, it was a little Asian boy, and they went and took it on the news or whatever, okay? And I believe it's an attempt to try to start some type of race war, okay, that this woman has done. Uh, Lauren Ham is an Asian woman, all right? Now I'm just thinking that they have plays like this all the time, and why is this play, uh, play being something that's, uh, being uh, blown way out of proportion, all right? Somebody's trying to start something, all right, between this uh, Lauren Ham's mother and the news, all right? And I didn't like the way this went all about, okay? I don't like it at all. And I'm gonna tell you what happened. The young girl, uh, the girl had took a three-pointer, all right? This is not Ham. Ham had took came up underneath this girl, pretty much undercut her and pushed her when she was on the way down, all right? And she pretty much tripped on her foot, which I think it was intentional. And Ham tried to kind of fall back and make it look like it was something inadvertent. And the girls got up. I saw Ham and pointed her finger at her and must have said something to her, all right? To flip a switch. And that girl had and took a roundhouse and put her on her back. Good. That's exactly what she, she deserves, all right, for running her damn mouth and taunting. So Ham had did, made the flagrant foul and then taunted that girl. Now, if the mother ordered uh, that girl to hit Ham or whatever and put her on her back, then, yes, that was wrong. All right. Hopefully, it was just a flus uh, frustrated play. The mom tried to uh, file charges. Okay, but one thing about that is, unless that girl that took a weapon or whatever and hit her with a chair or something like that, that just is something that was related to the play, all right? That uh, if there was a weapon, like a chair or like, I don't know, an object uh, to that effect, then it would be like second, uh, second degree assault, okay? But that's not the case. I used to be a competitive basketball player. And a move like that is pretty much like a pull the chair move. All right, that can injure somebody's ankle or somebody's knee. All right, that could cause permanent injuries. All right, I thought that was a very cheap, cheap move. Okay, now if the mom had told that, uh, the, uh, her daughter to hit that girl that she was wrong. And hopefully, I don't know, maybe uh, what's gonna happen is the girl that did the roundhouse is gonna get suspended. Maybe the mothers will be able to come to some type of, uh, I don't know, truce, okay? But I believe that this is a, something to try to, to, to start some type of race war. And again, if I didn't say that, I made an article like that before on the AAU game, you could pull that back or whatever, where the parent had filed, this is a young black boy that hit an Asian, uh, Asian boy. When the Asian boy made a cheap, flagrant play all right it started it and then he got put on his back and then the, the father tried to file charges and so forth okay and i'm gonna tell you that was something i'm i don't know but how can somebody make a, a flagrant play taunt somebody and then you get rocked or whatever you, you kind of get what you deserve you reap what you sow all right and who's to say they might have had some problems before i don't know but uh, both girls were competitive, but women could be, you know, more vicious than guys are. All right, from 
uh, doing the research on both of these girls, all right? So, also just, you know, be careful because you never know, you know, you guys might, if you have an opponent that you don't like, you never know, you guys might be end up being on the same team. So, you know, basketball is a uh, team sport. So, you know, it's good to show sportsmanship. It's just something uh, to stimulate thought. Now, I'm going to go get me something to eat. Let me know what you think about this video.